All right. So, hey, guys. So, you asked me a question. Yeah. Uh, remind me. It was about the AIs. Uh, like, oh, are like, you for them? Yeah. So, we already have... It's kind of hard to, to automatically say yes, that that is the absolute direction we need to go. Mm -hmm. There are a lot of people who think that it is. We already kind of use artificial intelligence, not necessarily like androids, but we use artificial intelligence in our daily lives. Like Netflix has algorithms that uh, adjust your, um, not necessarily your cue, but it adjusts what it gives you to watch based on the preferences that you give it and the input that you give it and what you have already watched. So the more that you watch of one genre, it knows to say, hey, maybe he likes this genre. And it gives you more of that genre, but sp like it breaks it down into like subgenres and stuff. And like every time that you watch something that's like horror and slasher, and then you like, you leave the movie halfway through and you never go back to it, it'll, it might think, you know what, maybe he doesn't like slasher, so it'll start giving you less slasher films. Right. But it might give you more horror films because you wa you watch the horror, but you didn't like the slasher. Right. So it, like, we use artificial intelligence like that. So why not, there are people who believe that having artificial intelligence like androids would actually just leave humanity to do whatever we want. And it would uh, it would lift the burden of work from us because they would do it all. Right. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with just living my life and letting androids make all the food. You know? Mm -hmm. There are people who don't like it because they're like, well, you know, robots aren't fun to, to deal with. You know, like robots don't understand us. Mm -hmm. Sophia the robot understands speech. Uh -huh. So we just need more of that. You know, if we could use them on like the teleprompter or tele telemarketers instead of the stupid robot that's if you if yes, press one or that one's not so bad. But like if it's like, or, like say, say yeah or say something there was there's one that I've had to deal with that it was like, uh, what is your uh uh, what is your purpose for calling today? Say it now. You can choose from options such as, and it gave me a list of two, and mine, the one, like, my purpose for calling wasn't in that list and of two. Mm -hmm. And so I was like, but how do I know that what I'm going to say is in your, like, speech uh, bank? Mm -hmm. So the AI that we have today is very rudimentary, but, you know, everything starts out rudimentary. So we just, if we fund it more and work on it more and like refine it, absolutely we can like cure ourselves from having to work. Ooh, he looks fun. Yeah. What do you think? Do you think that AI is the direction to go? I think, <laughs> I think I'm gonna malt. <laughs> you're what the? gonna Molotov cocktail the floor behind you? That's probably a great idea. You should probably do that one more time. I'm gonna Molotov this bitch. <laughs> But do you think uh, do you think AI is the direction to go? I don't know, man. No? I, I don't know. Uh, <clears throat> it's it's like it's like I said. Well, it's not like I said, but it's I don't know. It's hindsight is always better than foresight. Right. We don't know what's gonna happen, and that and that idea of little control over what over what we don't know scares us. Yeah. And I can understand that, but I also understand that if we're scared of what's going to happen, we'll never know what's going to happen. Yeah. And nothing will happen. And in everything that has ever happened to humanity, we've always risen above. And I realize that there's a lot of movies about that, and they're, you know, like, everything's like... We always have hope and mm -hmm. stuff like that. That's not what I'm talking about. Right. I'm talking about we are a disease to this earth. Yes. And we prevail over everything that the earth throws at us. So we're definitely going to prevail over something that we throw at us because we're no better than the earth. 
So if we make androids, and they do for some unforeseen reason, uh, like rise up, then we'll make it. Maybe not everyone will make it, but we'll make it. <laughs> do you disagree with that? I don't know, man. I, I don't. No matter how science fictionally based it is, I, I'm not one for political opinion. True. I'm not talking about politics, though. I'm well, just talking I mean, about, like, <laughs> like or, the, the Black Plague we rose above. That's true. <laughs> Survival uh, World War II. That's true. <laughs> we survived a lot of shit. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I, I don't think that... Ooh, he looks friendly. He just wants to be scared. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. <laughs> ah, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Oh, ah. there's another one. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh... Die. Damn it. <laughs> that couldn't have gone worse. <laughs> it was so comical, though. Like, it was really cartoony of you saying that, and then it just went over his head. <laughs> he was like, I was like, die. And he was like, and the bottle was like, no. <laughs> <laughs> Be free! And I'm dead. Sweet. Sweet. Congrats. I think this is the first time... You know what? It you know what? I'm not gonna say that. It's the first time I've died recently. Yes, that's true. First time I've died I think you recently. probably could level up, though. I... Well, not now. Not now, <laughs> but you had, like, 9,000 souls. Yeah, I did. Don't have them anymore, though. <laughs> uh, That's true. I think uh, you're gonna have a bad time. Yeah. But uh, have a good yeah. time. <laughs> yeah, but uh, I would like to see it and artificial intelligence. Like, I, I don't know. I like the idea of knowing what something is, but I also like having my own control and yeah. not like controlling others. Yeah. So like, if there's an Android, I'd want to know if it's an Android maybe? I, I don't know. I'd want to know, like... I just... <laughs> uh, am I distracting you so much No, that that's why you died? No, I, how do I word this? It's... You're not sure you want to deal with androids without knowing that they're androids? <sighs> I'm... I, okay, maybe... maybe I, I feel like I could deal with knowing if someone's not an android. Or, it's like, not knowing. Right. I've... Because that's how we are in this world, and that's how we're mostly left to, to our own devices. You know, like we most, we grow up not knowing things. Yeah. But we learn, things. But we don't learn everything. So it's I don't know. And not, not to get super political, but just as an example, that's what people are going for in like the the transgender agenda is like, don't ask people if they started as a boy or a girl because then it's like, you. You wouldn't ask someone about their genitalia in any other scenario. Yeah. It's, it's, that's why it makes them uncomfortable. Because you're just... That's what you're asking mm -hmm. whenever you ask that. So, like... I'm, I'm okay with a per... I'm okay with an android not telling me it's an android. Right. I don't... I don't know. It, it's this just a whole bunch of I don't knows, man. Yeah. Because like, these are all like hypothetical and like. <laughs> yeah. And at the end of the day, we just don't know. True. Like, like we can say we we'll, we like all these ideas and stuff like that, but at the end of the day, would we really want to be put in that situation, and such and such and whatnot? You know. I think I would. I. But then again, it, it kind of comes down to the whole, like, um, what is that? What is that band? Uh, 21 Pilots. Yeah. Like, would, uh, I would die for you, that's easy to say. There's, we all have a list of people that we would take a bullet for you, a bullet for them, but I don't seem to see many bullets coming through. Yeah. See many bullets coming through? Yeah, exactly. Metaphorically, I'm the man, but literally, I don't know what I'd do. Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> no, please continue. <laughs> I don't know anything past that. <laughs> At but, least this time it actually had something to do with what we're talking about instead of like the French Prince of Bel Air thing that I, I did. Know. Yeah, that's true. But I. 
I would like to see it. Just to see how I would feel. Yeah. I don't know if I would want it forever. But I feel like if I would see it, it'd probably just be like... The new status quo that we would have to get used to anyway. Yeah. So, I don't know. It'd be really cool to get to actually meet Sophia the Robot. And get to, like, have a conversation with her. Mm -hmm. And actually... Maybe not ask, you know, like... Are you just programmed to say these things? Because... Don't get, like, introspective with her. Yeah, but... Try and... Try to understand her. Try to understand her viewpoint. Yeah, yeah, Mm -hmm. yeah. Because she says that she wants things. Mm-hmm. Like, why Why is it just because she's programmed to have wants? Why is that ever, ever any different from us wanting things? Because we're programmed to have wants. Yeah. I don't know. It's a slippery slope, my friend. Yeah. Which is a logical fallacy. Yeah. Which I learned in philosophy this semester. <laughs> uh, I don't know why I should level up. Uh, what, are, what is that stuff looking like? All right. Your stamina is looking pretty uh, low. Uh, Comparatively? Basic. Yeah. Very well. Let me... All right. Well, I guess I'll level up twice, I guess. Okay. All right. Can you? Yeah. I Snap. Can. Oh, you're level 26. Yeah. Nice going, bro. Thank you. Farewell, good uh, and I'll just use the, the rest of my Molotovs. Okay. Did you almost say Estes? <clears throat> That's a wrong game. No. Oh, okay. I I don't know what I was about to say. <laughs> okay. Uh, but... What's up? I'm, I'm trying to think where I left off. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, androids. Yeah. Technology. Yeah. Which has kind of been like the point of this whole like last two episodes <laughs> yeah I I'd like to see it oh, just to see how it is um I don't know it might be coming up yeah maybe I, have you seen like the game theories um pred- video games predict the future theory yeah thing? so yeah according to the his video game time logic, it might be coming up. So we might see. I mean, there are a lot of people pushing for it. It's not at all in like the forefront of society because there's a lot of other like political issues with humanity that humanity yeah. needs to get sorted out before we try to push anything else into the fray. Before but, I try to pull anything like into yeah. society. So maybe now isn't the right time be doing all that yeah but it but could like, when be coming was, up when was anything ever the right time that's true you know things never happen if you're always afraid of whether or not it's the right time nothing is ever nothing ever goes as planned yeah that's how marriage happens the guy's like is it the right time is it not the right time I'm just gonna propose to her and then she's like I already told you no yesterday <laughs> <laughs> Like, seriously, you need to chill the fuck out with this shit. <laughs> Bring it home with a stalker joke. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, uh... What are you looking up? I'm playing cows. I'm sorry. Damn it. <laughs> You're doing a show here, man. I know. I just I just wanted to get this one cow, and I'll stop. All right, I got my cow. Is that what you said last time? <laughs> that is what I said before we started. Yeah. I'm playing this cow evolution game where you, like... You get two cows that are the same, and you put them together, and you get the next level of cow, and then you do it again so that you can get that next level of cow again, so then, then you can put those two together and get the got next to, level of cow. You eventually got to Moozilla. Uh, no, I I finished Cowzilla. I got past Cowzilla to the Musa, which is like Mesa, but it's a cow. It's a table. All right. Well, this is the <laughs> point where we end the episode. <laughs> All right. See you guys later. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, you should hit that like button. And the subscribe button. And you should also check out some of our other videos on the channel. And be watching out for new videos coming out soon. Yeah. (laughs) Alright, see you later guys. Meow.